We're going to, today, um, we're coming off of yesterday. Yesterday was actually a really nice session. Ben is here two days in a row this week, and so we're filming two days in a row because of that. And I'm glad because yesterday I thought um, was a was a real productive session. We worked on just back casting her, stopping her to the whistle, recalling to us and stopping her. She did a really nice job. Um, we talked and then what we did at the end was we stretched her out and gave her a little bit longer retrieve. It's a little cooler today. Yesterday was kind of warm. It's windy, it's kind of overcast, it might rain here shortly. Um, so we're gonna see how she does today. She hasn't done much, it's the, sap it's the afternoon. She hasn't done anything physically, I didn't even get them out for a walk yet this morning. So we'll see where her energy is at, um, but we're gonna do the same thing. Today, based on what we did yesterday, I wanna replicate it. We are in a different spot, not intentionally. I probably would have went back to the same spot, um, but my neighbor's turkey hunting. So, um, and I don't know, we don't know if he's turkey hunting right now or not, but he does turkey hunt on that in that area and we don't want to disturb him. So we're going to, I liked how we did it yesterday on the brown ground, um, freshly tilled soil, food plots is what they are. But the white dummy stood out and it became very clear to her when she spun around right where to go. Um, and, and we also used the edge. We used a, a transition from green to brown as a straight line for her. I'm in a little bit narrower food plot here. There is green on both sides and I'm probably gonna use that. My thought right now is because this food plot is the width it is, it's a little too wide for her. When she spins around, I don't wanna run her down the middle of it because there's just too much stuff that potentially could draw her off. I don't want the dog turning around and running off at an angle. I want him turning around and going straight out. So we are going to look, I'm going to look at using this spot. So, um, you know, normally I wouldn't say jump spot to spot daily, but today we're just changing it up. Um, I am going to look, because I do want to use a relatively straight edge. So actually let's, Ben, let's walk over to here. I might use this. I'll show you what I'm going to do with this as a kind of a corridor. Now. This is serving as my kind of warm up with her. I want to make sure we've got nice heel work with her. Good connection. Good. She's getting real nice and pretty snappy with that sit to the whistle heel. So what I'm going to I'm going to look at doing here I want to look at this edge cuz this is kind of a nice straight edge. The other thing that's nice about it is when you look up in here, you see these little pine trees. That's gonna, I think that's where I'll be and she'll come back into that. Again, it's an idea of give her a little bit of a backdrop. Um, she's got that tendency to kind of want to run past us. This doesn't have to be real long. I don't think they should be real long. When you're doing these kind of micro drills that are developing specific skills, like with her, we're talking about sending her back with a back cast. Um, recall with the whistle. I don't need her to go great distance. So we kind of compress the area and maintain a little bit more control that way. That's what we're gonna do here. Then what I'll probably do is similar to yesterday, I probably will stretch her out. And if, you'll, if you've watched the series, when we ran into the issue with her going back, this is where we, this, is, this was in the winter, the channel or corridor that we used to send her back and forth for multiple dummies. We might do that at the end of this drill and see how that's going for her. You'll see a drastic improvement, I think, I hope anyway. So. To start out with, we've got this nice brown area here. I don't want to put the dummy way out in the middle of it. I'm going to put it right here so as she comes down, it's right here and smacks her right in the face and the dummy is there. So let's heal her forward. So we're going to get her heel and set this up very similar to what we did yesterday. Sit. Good. Now to start out, we'll simplify it. We won't ask her to come to us. We won't ask her to run off of a remote sit and recall. We're just gonna have her sit. I'm gonna pitch a dummy up and over. It's short, look how close I am to her. Go back, go back. Good girl, good girl. Good, come on. Nice big bright dummy in the white dummy in the brown dirt. She can't miss it. Good, here, 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 right here. Come on, good, good. 
Little hesitant to spin around for us. Heel, heel, heel. So we're, we're gonna warm her up and kind of break that rust loose, break any hesitation loose. And she'll, she'll probably start to anticipate it. Remember what she did yesterday to us. Do it, same thing, real simple. Up and over. This time I turn my back, I make sure she doesn't creep. I'm gonna walk back a little bit further this time. Now, I'm gonna pause slightly longer before I send her back. Go back. Good girl, that a dog, good girl. Come on, good, easy, e here, 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 right here, good, good dog. Good, she's got nice enthusiasm here today. Still under control, doesn't lose, it, isn't losing it. Very good, good, dead, dead, dead. Good, heel, heel. So there was a couple subtle things about her that time where she stopped, good. I blew the whistle, I cast her with my right hand up. I held it and held it and held it, just that extra probably two or three seconds. And when I did that, her head faded off. She was almost slow motion gonna go to turn and so I waited I wasn't gonna send her with her already starting because that she's the one dictating when she's gonna go at that point instead what I did was I, I was like this her head started to turn and so I went like this and as soon as I did that she went like this and she watched me I counted thousand one thousand two get back and she spun and went so I changed it from her knowing what was coming and starting to turn her head to just get her attention. I didn't want to make any more noise. I didn't have to whistle again. I just shuffled. And when I shuffled, she went like this. And as soon as I, she went like that and focused, I was in one, go back, and she went. So it's, I don't want her to send her at the wrong time because what's gonna happen is she'll start to turn her head and then just go because she's used to me saying go back in that cadence. Heel, good girl, good girl. Time we're gonna do it a little bit different. Good. Now I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna to try to recall her to me. And I, I got a feeling she's gonna spin on me, so I'm not going to. Just talk myself out of it. I don't wanna set this up to have her do it wrong. Not yet. She doesn't know it well enough. Look at her jump right now. She's jumpy, jumpy, jumpy. She wants to go back, go back, go back. I shouldn't be saying those words. Easy. We're just, no, 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 no. Here, here, here. Right here. Not gonna get mad at her. I'm gonna start learning from my own mistake here. She's becoming real, real keen to go. Here, come here, come here, come on. Good. Sit. And I don't want to put it. I don't want to put that fire out right now. She's doing. She's doing a nice job. She really wants to do this. She really wants to cooperate. She really wants to do it. She's just doing it at the wrong time. So there's a there's a minute right. There's a second right there where I have to go. Okay. Make a note of it because she's getting a little bit jumpy. So we're not gonna put dummies out like we just did anymore. We did that to warm up. Now what we're gonna do is reward her for listening the right way with the dummy.
Good girl. That's a good dog. Good dog. Heel. First one, let's get her all the way back to us. So we don't get this dog that starts to creep in slowly and anticipate the back. So that was good. Good heel. Let's do it again. Get a, and if we get a good, if she comes in nicely, I'll stop her. If she stops nicely, I'll pitch a bumper over her. Come on, come on, come on. Go back, go back. Good girl, good girl. Good. Here, right here, right here, thank you. Good girl, good girl. Good, did, did. We see her attention starting to fade a little bit. Right here. Heel. And she's getting, bugs are kind of bothering her a little bit. So what I'm gonna do is, let's shift. Let's move. Let's do something different right now. I'm just gonna change the setup to keep her thinking and engaged with me. She's so routine, you saw how focused she was to start out. Now all of a sudden we've done something so routine here. Good. Good. Come on. Good girl. Good girl. Good heel. 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 Go back, go back, good girl. Good girl, a little bit tougher, good dog. That's a good dog. Here, 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 right now, right here. Good, good dog, very good. See how much more focused she is dialed in with me here. So we changed it. Don't let it get bored for her. Don't let her get bored, don't let this get boring. No, 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 you, come on. And all of a sudden that energy is back. Here, 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 here. We just decided to change the, the game. Sit. I'm gonna change the game again. I gotta keep it, I gotta keep her interested. You can see right now she's bored. She just laid down. So we're gonna recall her to us. Come on, come on. Good. 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 Now I'm gonna pick it up myself. Very good. So the temptation for her isn't up and over. This looks a lot different than the going back drill. So I don't, she's, not, she's never gone left or right. So she doesn't even know what left or right is. So we're not risking anything by her being confused at this point. She's never done this. But I also want her to understand that when she, she did a nice job coming to the stop to the whistle. And I want her to understand that there's dummies that get thrown that she doesn't get to go after. So now I'm gonna look at her focus right now. Look at look at the attention she's paying. It's because I've mixed this up. Come on, that's a good dog. Good girl. Good. Now I bring her all the way in, and she comes in nicely with good enthusiasm. Come here. Good. Good girl. Good. Good. Now. 
Let's do this. And now what we're doing is, because she's starting to get this concept of going back, just starting to get a grip, a grip on it, we're just mixing in kind of a, you know, this is kind of like a memory. We've done these a lot. Denial, turn her own, heal her back. We add in the sit to the whistle. Go back. Good. Good girl. That's a good dog. Good girl. And that brown ground, here, 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 here. You could see that coming. Right here, right here. You could really see it coming. Boy, she had a lot of momentum coming back. She's got, she's got some energy in there. Good, dead, dead, good. And we gotta fix that, but that's okay. Good dog. Sit down. Sit down. Come on. Here. Come here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. That's that puppy. That's that little bit of immaturity that I've seen in her. She just has a hard time containing it sometimes. And I'm going to be done. There's no reason for me to go much further than that right now. We got, we got past the boredom. We got some value out of today. We changed it up a little bit. We found out how to really keep her attention and focus and excitement. Um, it's enough. It's enough for right now. Um, what we'll do, let's do this, Ben, on the way back. So I wanna, get, I wanna give her a chance to stretch again. I don't mind her having the ability to get a long retrieve or two in. See how she's sloppy in her heel right there? As I turn into her a little bit slow, She's gotta get out of the way. So let's do this. Watch, watch, heal. This is just like we did weeks and weeks and weeks ago, and she really had a hard time doing it. Couldn't get her to go back to the same spot three times in a row. We did it in this exact same spot that there was snow and things looked a lot different then. But we did it the op we're doing it the opposite direction right now. We're just gonna run it back the other way. So we're gonna go back to something she's done, but hasn't done for some time, hasn't done it for a while. Couple little transitions here with cover that we normally did not do, hadn't done with her in this spot. We know that grass creates a little bit of an issue with her wanting to get her nose down. That lead's gonna come off nice and slow. Sit, good. Now these are a little bit, these are longer than what we've, we've done in the past here, but it's been a long time since we did it in the first place. So this is really a new spot for her new setup for her. Bella. Nice push. Now she went past the first one. Come on, come on, did switch. Thought we had her through it, but Good girl. Good, easy, 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 here, here, right here, 
Easy. Good. Good. Heel. 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 Come on. Come on. Heel. Right here. Sit. Sit. Watch. Zella. Good girl. Now the third one is the highest, stands out probably the best. It's a little bit smaller dummy, but it's brighter white. Good, here, right here. No, right here. Good, good, hold, good, good, dead, dead, heel, heel, heel. I'm actually going to line her for this one just to help her. Watch. Bella. And there she runs the drill really well. Go back to uh, episodes probably around 60, Ben. Is that where we we're posting right now? I just got done posting the series. Good girl. I'm around the 60 mark, and you'll see we did this for about two weeks and couldn't get past it. We took a week off came back to it and she and she did real well good here 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 and so I just wrote a gun an article for gun dog magazine talking about just this sequence of how we took a week break from it we really focused on it for about a week and a half to two weeks and she got each of the parts and pieces to this pretty well and then I tried piecing them back together and she just, I just couldn't get her to, I just couldn't get her to be able to put this whole thing together. And so I was to the level of frustration. She was probably hit a, a, a mental barrier or roadblock. And so what we decided to do was we said, let's stop doing this for, let's go to another area. Let's work on something new. Let's not do this drill for at least a week. And I think we took seven, maybe to 10 days off of it. And then we came back to it, remember that? And when we came back to it, we started real small with it, but we went three, and, and then we ended up doing four dummies. And she just, boom, boom, boom. And ever since then, going back to the same spot for multiple dummies has not been an issue. But it, it, it was a process that took us probably three weeks to get past it. And it all started right here because I started pitching multiple dummies into cover and sending her back for him and she'd get the first one always and then the second one she'd hunt short and fade out the third one she'd hunt short and fade out i couldn't get her to go back to the same spot and i think mentally she just thought i already picked it up it's gone but there was two or three of them there and she just couldn't get it past couldn't get past the idea that there was still some there and she didn't believe me when i said it was so by laddering out and lining out over the process of a couple weeks and that's why you shouldn't chew all that grass but then we got it, we got it to work and then we put pieced it back together. Heel. And that way for us to finish out is really positive. That's a good ending to this session. And now we'll put her back up. So she can go back to, to the kennel and think of something that she just did really well that she struggled with not too long ago. And she can put that new stuff, the back casting, she can kind of think on that for a little while. We're gonna get her a drink of water here too. But it's this grass, you keep them up. She's a part cow. Heel. So that's it, that's a really good way to end this session. Nice, nice, nice piggyback off of yesterday. I'm dead.